Hey guys, it's Mine. Uh, just bringing you a quick little Elden Ring video today, um, as I've had a few people request how to find this weapon in particular. Um, it is a little bit out of the way, but most people might have already found it by now. I'm a little bit late to the party, uh, but hopefully this helps the people who haven't found it just yet. It's not an amazing weapon by itself. Uh, people are using it for a specific build to abuse a bug at the moment uh, for like PvP. I'm not going to outline any of the details of that build because I don't want it to be abused any more than it has been. Um, but by itself, the weapon, it's okay. It's all right. Um, the weapon in question is the Antsper Rapier. It's a deck stacking or dex scaling rapier. Comes with the Ash of War Impaling Thrust, which goes through guard. Pretty good. Um, it also applies Rot Blood, which is pretty good against enemies too. Um, so it is a decent rapier all in all um, when you're just using it for just regular gameplay. Um, putting your own Ashes of War on it too is quite effective, um, makes it a much better weapon than its just base type as well. Uh, so what you want to do is starting from the Dectus Lift, which you'll find in the Leonia Lake uh, a little bit later on in the game, you're looking at it about here. Um, starting from there, you're going to want to go roughly northwest uh, for a little bit. You'll find a side of grace just here, right next to the lift. Pretty good. Um, just follow this path all the way across um, and then drop down off of this cliff face when it gets a little shorter. You might have to go around a bit longer if you can't take the fall damage. Then you'll hit this side of grace here. This is the Erd Tree Hill gazing side of grace. Uh, ooh, yeah, something like that. Um, and where you're aiming for is this little ravine here. So you want to come down this ravine around this little rock just there and then you'll end up at the Shaded Castle um, towards the top of the map. That's where you want to be heading. Um, I've sped this up just a little bit. It is a bit long so if you do want to skip the path you can just go to 3 minutes 20 in the video. That'll skip the whole thing. Otherwise you're basically just running through this ravine straight line to the Shaded Castle. There's a little scarab there and he'll drop the ball um, he's got a Ash of War, um, it's called Blood Blade, I think. Um, it's an Ash of War that like sort of throws blood off your blade. It's kind of cool, not amazing. It's just sort of there if you want to pick it up on the way through. Um, you can dodge old horse mate back there. Um, he's not too much of a threat if you're on your own horse. Um, just weave around him, go around that left side of the, the rock in the middle and you should be fine. Uh, follow the path and then you'll end up at the Shaded Castle here. Um, there's a lot of like poison moat around with a lot of those really terrible fucking flowers. Just a lot of them. So you can kind of skirt around them to the left side, just hug the left wall. You'll end up going around them without uh, attracting any attention. And then you'll end up in this little uh, area around the corner of the shaded castle. You want the castle to be behind you. Um, then you will know you're in the right place because you got this bitch. Um, and then the golem in the background. Um, I'm a little over leveled for the area, so it might be a little bit easier for me than if you were starting out. Um, but that is the Antsper Rapier. You also get her helmet and her chest, which is pretty good. Um, I'm just showcasing a little bit of the gameplay of the Rapier here. It isn't leveled. Um, this is just the base straight after picked it up. Um, that, that, that damage is just sort of scaling off of whatever stats I've got. I think I've got some dexterity stacked in. Um, so I'm doing a little bit more damage. Um, it's just your regular rapier layout and nothing too special. That's about it. Well, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, hopefully it'll help you out a little bit. Um, I might make some videos on some of the more meta weapons or the more popular weapons um, and how to find them. If there's any particular weapons or items that you guys need to find or want to find, just let me know and I'll make a video on it. Uh, once again, thanks for watching. Uh, it's been me, Mide, and I'll see you later.